Beardo Benjo. Cryptocurrency. What is it? I don't know, but I do know some words associated with cryptocurrency. Things like DeFi, Destabilize, Blockchain Technology, and Non-Fungible Tokens. Did I sound smart saying them? No, because I have no idea what any of them mean, but they are important to some people and cryptocurrency is a thing. It's happening. People are very excited about this new digital imaginary money. Why am I talking about cryptocurrency? I'm talking about crypto because there's a game that's just released called Revomon. Now, Revomon is a VR game, an open world RPG where you capture, collect, battle, and train monsters. If that sounds familiar, it's because it comes from the same team who worked on Pokemon VR. Pokemon VR is a product I tried out a while back and I actually really enjoyed it. I found it to be very charming. I found it to have a huge amount of potential, but the problem with it was, it was Pokemon. And Nintendo shut it down because Nintendo loves shutting things down. That's their favorite thing to do in the entire world. If you take their IP, they will shut you down and then they'll shut your children down and your children's children will also be shut down. So of course, Pokemon VR was shut down. Now the developers have come back with Revomon and they've tied the game in some manner which I can't quite wrap my head around to crypto, to non-fungible tokens. I believe the creatures you capture you can sell on an auction for real digital imaginary currency. Now, I don't know how really any of this works. I'm gonna jump in today and try the game out. I can't speak too much about the crypto aspect of it because I'm just not knowledgeable enough. Now, I would say I'm hoping to find a way that you can play this game that isn't attached to the crypto side of it because ultimately there will be younger people playing this who I don't think should be exposed to that kind of world. Uh, markets and shares and, and stocks and investment. I don't think that's the right place but I understand why adults would get quite excited about this being able to catch creatures and sell them for actual cash. Let's see what this game's about. This is Revomon running on the Quest 2 natively. You can get this via side quest. Let's catch some Revos. Gotta catch them all, Revomon. That's the song, that's how it goes. Ah, yes, this is definitely Pokemon VR, isn't it? Okay, welcome to Revomon. Oh my God, are you all right? Rosh, mate, you're not looking okay. You need to go to the hospital. Christ. This is the first thing I see when I load into the game. Oh. All right. Okay, get off the table. What is going on? All right, welcome to Revomon. Now, before I even get into the gameplay, before I even get going today, I'm going to point out something really strange. I had to make an account for the game, which makes sense. The game's connected to crypto, so you can attach wallets and all this kind of stuff. I didn't do any of that. But I had to create an account for the game, and one of the requirements is you have to use all lowercase for both your username and and your password, and you can't use any characters. That seems like a real step back in terms of security for a game that uses real money. That's kind of scary. Um, right, let's talk to this hipster lady. Louisa, hello Louisa. I heard a very disturbing noise outside. Can you please go and see? Is that it? Is that? Okay, right. Bye. Out here, yeah? Oh, I've gone into space. Right. This looks like the outside world to me. Uh, okay. Oh, brilliant. Okay, this is, yeah, this is definitely Pokemon VR here. Oh, it was so easy to fight. There's people <laughs> talking and all kinds of weird stuff. How do I get my Revomons? You've all got Revomons. Where's my Revomon? All right, let's look at the options first because I've got a clue on bloody... Oh, I've got a little camera here, look. Hello, that's me, little selfie camera. Hey! How's it going? Very nice. That's my eyeball there. Right, can I... Right, mute my mic. I don't want people listening to me. Mute others, yeah. Let's not listen to other people's nonsense. Let's try and find where to go to get a bloody Revomon. Uh, look at these little creatures. They, they do look quite cool. Now, that one looks like a Goron. Now, I did notice that the starting creatures all look like Zelda um, uh, creatures. So, that's a Goron. Quite clearly. There he is. Hello, mate. Yeah, why are you fighting me? I'm not another Revomon. Um, one of the other ones is a Zora. And then the last one is like a Deku. So they they decided to 
take another Nintendo property, um, <laughs> which was a bold choice. All right, do I stand in this big shiny light? It seems right, doesn't it? Mm, no, that's not done anything. Uh, I might go speak to Louisa again because she sent me out here for seemingly no reason. Louisa, what's going on? I went outside to listen for your disturbing noise and there was nothing, just a bunch of kids running around with fake Pokemon. Where do I go? Right, this is it. I'm going back out there. Right, I'm going to have to have an actual explore now, aren't I, really? Right, so they're fighting over here. This bit seems fun. But, you know, there's no point. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, picking creatures. See, right, look at that. That's a Deku. That's a Goron. That is a Zora. Welcome to the Legend of Zelda. Um, what do I want? It's even called Dekut and Gorlit and Zarel. Come on, guys. A little more subtle. Hector, hey you, please select a Revomon and help me. Which one do I want? <sighs> Deku, Gorlit. I guess I kind of want this. This guy looks the coolest, right? Gorlit. Let's get Gorlit. Let's have him. Oh. Can I sell him now for big bucks immediately? I want to just sell him straight away. Make some cash. Oh, it looks like it's your first time to face a wild Revomon. Let me help you. First, to fight a wild Revomon, you must use your slingshot. Just select an orb containing your battle-ready Revomon, aim and fire it at the other. Um, oh, okay. Take this, you stupid dragon. Are we done? Where's my... Oh, there he is. What's this person doing here? Nice. Now use your battle window to select an action to do against the wild Revomon. Right, let's let's do some moves. Let's scratch him. Take that. This is actually nicer than the, what they had in Pokemon VR. Uh, scratch him again. Yep. Done. I think we win. Did we win? We won. Ah, they haven't fixed that yet. There's no like kind of end animation to the fights. I, I noticed that in Pokemon VR. Things just finish without much real reason. Look at this thing. This is cool. Oh, it's gone. So I guess just I should just shoot this at this spider. Take that. <laughs> oh, it's kind of cool, right? Is that mine? Are you my one? Yeah, okay. Alright. Beat up this spider, please. Yes, that's it. Kill it. Kill the spider. Kill. Right, you ready? Uh, do it. Uh, how do I catch things? Oh, he's well dead. He's found it. Okay, so I, I I won that battle, yeah? How you feeling? You feeling all right? Can I just check on you? Oh, let's fight that chicken. Take that, you stupid chicken. Oh, I might die, actually, because I'm really low on health. Oh, yeah, I'm going to die. Just keep... Right, think I died. Uh... Louisa, can you help me out, please? <laughs> heal. How do I heal? <laughs> Speak to me, Louisa. Why are you doing this? Okay, so Gorlet's... Gorlet is fine. Gorlet is... Doesn't need healing. All right. See, you're absolutely useless. Kill that one again. Gorlet. Get it. The actual fighting's really nice. Like this is is super intuitive. Like it, it just feels like Pokemon. You know, you select moves. The moves I believe have. I don't know if they've got PP. Um, so you might be able to use them just as much as you like. Yeah, it doesn't seem like the attacks have PP. Oh no, they do. Thirty-five of thirty-five. Thirty of thirty-five. Forty of forty. Twenty-five of twenty-five. I'll say I've learned Ember now. Okay, so the attacks do have. PP, so you can't just keep using them. Um, but the real question is, how do I catch things? Is there a shop somewhere? Do I need to buy balls? Buy myself some balls? Right, so in here, we've got some actual people to fight. Sailor Claytus here is probably going to beat the hell out of me. Um, should we try? Hello? Do you want to have a fight? Alright, we should win, because we've got the type advantage. Ember. There we go. And again, just Ember it. Spider must be grass type, right? That's it. Very nice. That thing. We've beaten loads of them. Just scratch it to death. Uh, done. God, that was easy. 
What did I get for beating you? Did I get anything? Uh, leveled up again. Very cool. Uh, I don't think I actually got anything, though. So, this is my menu. I don't seem to have a like a game wallet. I've got 102 game, game bucks, I guess. Um, it's in here that you can see the market and you can actually, like, buy. So... This, there's a spook coon, spook coon here, and it's worth 1,000 p. What's that? It, don't have enough money. I think that's actual. Where this where it becomes actual like currency, and things get a little bit crazy because this is this is an actual marketplace here with all these Pokemon for sale. I'm gonna keep calling the Pokemon. I've committed now. It's too late. 18,000, 20,000. Wow. I bet they bet they're bloody good. They're not even that good. Right. Now the thing I need to figure out is how do I get your current sales and the current money. I've got no money. Now what I need to figure out is how I get more Revomon. How do I actually capture them? Can you capture them? I guess you can. Uh, burn them! Burn them both! Burn him as well. I don't care that he's a fire type. Just burn him. So just keep just keep burning everything. Uh, scratch him actually. That's probably for the best. Oh, I'm gonna get. Oh no, he's getting destroyed. Get in there. Good job, fella. Uh oh, this thing is a water type, so we might die here. Unless it doesn't know any water attacks because it's such a low level. Level four, level eight. I should have this in the bag. Come on, take the victory. Take the W. Yes. Yeah, very similar to Pokemon VR, it does suffer from some of the same issues, like um, you finish a battle and there's no real kind of ending to the battle, it just kind of finishes, which is a bit random. Um, I would like to see kind of like a nice little screen at the end, a little bit of a summary, that would be, that would be ideal. Can I sneak around here? Oh. Endless nothingness. My absolute favourite. Right, there's look, we can see the other places. There's something floating off in the distance over there. Alright, this is cool. This is a nice aesthetic. You can spectate the PvP fight. Oh, can I? Spectate the PvP fight. Oh! I'm in like an arena. Oh, it's finished. That person's flying away. What's happening? What's happening? Ah, uh, something's gone horribly wrong, hasn't it? Right, I'm back. I'm not going into that endless hole of death anymore. That wasn't fun for anybody. Should we kill this thing? Come here, soil boy. Gorlet, destroy the worm. Burn the worm to the ground. Oh no, did he die? Oh, Gorlet, mate, you're going to die. This thing's level 19. Uh, run. Let's run away. Good job, come on. Let's check out what's going on around here. These creatures are far too high level for us to be battling, but... Um... Oh, a bit laggy. Oh, very laggy. Oh. Okay, there's a shop over there. That's positive. That's where I need to be. Right, how do I capture Revomon? Okay, so we got Burn Cure, Full Cure, Freeze Cure. Yeah, this is fine. Sleeping Cure. Potions. I've barely... I've not got any mo enough money for that. 3,000! Oh, 300 for one. That's Even that's too much money. I've got 134. I'm absolutely skint. What's a green orb? What does it do? It's all, it's all well and good having it on show, but what does it, what does it do? Clerk, do you want to tell me what any of this stuff does? Carry me. Well, oh, okay. I can't afford any of this stuff. Uh... <laughs> Hi right, mate, what what does any of the, what does this do? What, what's this? What does that do? There you go. I'll take them, please. Did that let me do it? Did that? Surely not. I don't even have a bag. No. No. I don't think that worked. Right. Right. Don't understand what this is. It's confusing. Uh, um, I can't afford anything in the shop. And I don't know how to catch these creatures. As much as I want them, I can't seem to have them. Alright. 
I'm level 18. I can't be fighting stuff. Maybe if I just let them kill me, I'll end up back at that hospital. Yes, back at the hospital. Hello, um, nurse lady. All right, he's already healed. How how do I capture more Revomons? Do I need to put the cryptocurrency in? Do I have to purchase them with real cash? Is that what's happening here? It feels like that's what's happening. Ah! Ah! Right. I figured it out. These buttons do work. They haven't really been working for me. Right. Misc medicine orbs. Orbs have got to be what catch things, right? Let's bloody try it. Let's bloody try it. Right, come on. Let's find a Revomon, shall we? Um, let's find one. Look at him. He's cool. He's a little spooky thing. Just scratch it just once. Don't hit it too hard. Nice. Okay, now, if we go to orbs, can I catch it? <gasps> oh my god. Get in my crypto wallet. Okay, is that mine now? Is that my new friend? <gasps> I've got a spider friend. Right, okay, cool. Right. Oh. Hello, mate. You all right? Cooking on gas now. Let's go catch all these creatures. Oh, I'm liking it now. Now that I know what I'm doing, I like it. Okay. Fungus boy. Oh, immediately dead. That wasn't great. Um, look at this. I love this glitchiness. The glitchy, glitchy characters. Look at that. You're just not okay. Oh, look at that one. Is that what he evolves into? He's having a bit of a trouble there, disappearing off the edge, but he looks wicked. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. I'm glad I picked the rock one, or the fire one. Very glitchy. Um, I think that's pretty much all there is to see. Um, this area, Route 1, the other town, and then there's like a battle arena where I kind of briefly went there, but then I fell through the floor and couldn't couldn't stop myself from falling. Now, I think all the characters are the same. I haven't been able to customize my character. This is just this is just me. Um, I wasn't given the option to create a character, so I think everyone plays as the same character. Um, you can chat with people. I've got mics muted. This is meant to be played as a very social experience. Um, it's very obvious to me that it's still in quite early development. Um, it's a little bit glitchy. Certain areas don't run particularly nicely. They're quite slow. They're quite laggy. But it has the charm that Pokemon VR had. And if they can continue to leverage that, and hopefully now they won't get any cease and desists or any shutdown orders from someone like Nintendo. Look, normal fish. Oh, tuna. How bizarre. Um, yeah, so without the, the threat of, of legal action or anyone coming along to shut them down, hopefully that allows them to push this and turn it into something that it... That it could be, you know, the, the, the promise could be realised. Because I think Quest players, VR people, and VR players and gamers in general want games like this. Social experiences are also games. Places they can jump into, spend some time, talk to some people, battle and collect some creatures. It makes perfect sense for VR. I don't know how big, I say, the crypto part of it is, is going to be. So, for example, I mean, can I sell? Can I sell something already? Could I could I sell this, this the rubbish little two? Where's that little two? Which one's the two one? Uh, that one. I could sell that for... Ooh, who knows? Um, what's a good price? 20. Because it's not very good, so sell. Auction it for 20. Yes. And now that's on the auction. So I guess someone could buy it? But it's unclear as to whether they're buying that with in-game currency or or crypto. It's like a P. It's like a little P twenty. Is that the Revo symbol? I'm I'm not entirely sure. So I don't know how that that section of the game works. It does seem that you don't have to engage with it if you don't want to. Um, there's a shiny one over there. Look, is that actually a shiny Revo one? Looks like it. it's a different color to the other one. Is that someone's pet? Let's see if I can catch it from here. No, I can't catch that. That belongs to someone. Okay, so that's cool. There are shiny variants as well, which I assume if you catch, you'll be able to sell for more. And then that kind of non-fungible token thing comes into play, whereby if you own that one, 
then you could sell it. Uh, yeah, I'm not I'm not a hundred percent down with the kids and all that kind of stuff, but I see the promise in this as a game, as a Pokemon clone that you can play in VR with a big open world where you can go around and capture creatures. I see the potential in that. Um, and I'd like to see it reach its full potential. This is nice. This is a nice shiny one. Good job. Good job, more Fran VR. Very, very cool. Um, Viper. Viper, yes. Uh, this is Revomon. Viper. I think I'll leave it here. I don't think I need to really show anything else. Um, if you were a big fan of Pokemon VR or never got a chance to play Pokemon VR, this is something you can jump into now. Oh, that's a weird looking thing. It's like a Muppet. Hello, Muppet. Crazy. Um, you don't need to add a trust wallet or buy any Revo to play this. You can just play it without investing in the crypto. Have to stress that you don't need it to play the game. It is a feature of it, but you don't need it. If you've enjoyed, please do leave a like, leave a comment, and hit subscribe, and I'll see you soon for another one. I'll leave you with a nice close look at my little Pokemon friend here. I'm going to keep saying Pokemon because, for Christ's sake, they're quite clearly Pokemon, aren't they? Let's all just be honest with each other. Weird little thing. Revomon. Needs a lot of work, has potential, haven't got a clue what the crypto bit is. Enjoy! Enjoy!